Welcome to the Boston Institute of Finance's Financial Calculator video tutorial series. In this video, we will cover amortization. Let's take a look at the following financial scenario. Bill and Susan are buying their first house. The price is $250,000. They are making a down payment of 20% and financing the balance for 30 years at 4% fixed interest. The first payment is due the first of next month. You will find the answers to the following questions. What is their monthly mortgage payment? How much interest will Bill and Susan pay in the first year? How much loan principal is paid in the first year? You will see this set of calculations performed on the HP-12C, which uses RPN entry, and at the end of the video, the keystrokes for the HP-10B2, which uses algebraic entry. Before you begin, Make sure to clear your calculator's financial memory registers. Use prefix F and the key with the word FIN above it. You may set the display to two or four digits by pressing prefix F and two or prefix F and four. For calculations that involve amortization, make sure your calculator's mode is set to end instead of begin. On the HP 12C, the display will be blank to indicate end mode and the word begin if it's in begin mode. Starting with finding the monthly mortgage payment, you will use the time value money financial registers. It is stated that they will pay 20% of the purchase price, so making the total down payment will leave 80% of the purchase price. Begin with finding that amount. Key in 250,000, enter 0.8 then press the multiply key. 200,000 will be put into the present value register. Press the PV key. The future value will be a paid off mortgage, which means zero. Since a zero is in the FV register when financial registers are cleared, you don't need to manually enter the zero. Just be aware it's already there. Now let's look at entering number of payments and the interest. On the HP 12C, the keys in the upper row on the left have small blue text saying 12 multiply and 12 divide. Using the prefix G key, 30 years can be entered as 30 prefix G N. Note how this automatically multiplied by 12 for the correct number of payments, 360. Could you manually enter 360 and press the N key? Certainly. A financial planner will develop a familiarity with multiples of 12 corresponding to years. It's a matter of personal preference on how you choose to input this data into the financial registers. Next, interest rate. It is implied that 4% fixed interest is yearly, and since interest will be compounded monthly, it is necessary to divide 4% by 12. There are two ways to do this. One is to manually do the division by keying in 4, pressing enter, 12, then press the division key. Point 0.3 repeating can be entered into the interest register, and that's fine. The other way to enter this is using the prefix G key. Enter 4, prefix G, then I. To finish the calculation, press the payment register key, PMT. $954.83 will be their monthly payments. Next, let's look at how much interest they will pay in the first year. The HP 12C provides a very fast mechanism for computing that amount with the amortization function. The first year means the first 12 payments. Key in 1, enter that into N, key in 12, and press prefix F. Amort, located in the top row far left. Negative $7,935.92. This is negative, indicating payment going towards interest in months 1 through 12. The last question is answered with a single keystroke. The key, which exchanges the X and Y registers on the HP 12C, will give you the amount of the 12 monthly payments applied to the principal, $3,522.04. When you pressed the Amort key, the HP 12C computed two things at once. 
the amount applied to the interest and the amount applied to the principal. Pressing the exchange key simply switches what number is displayed. Let's look at the keystrokes for the HP 10B2. Number of digits to be displayed can be set to 2 or 4 by pressing the downward shift, disp, 4, or downward shift, disp, 2. Make sure the mode is set to end. If the calculator display has the letters BEG, then press the downward shift key, then the begin end mode key. To keep things as simple as possible, also set number of payments per period to 1. Enter 1, downward shift, payments per year key. Part 1 of the question is finding monthly payments. Enter 250,000, multiply by 80, percent key, and equals. Enter this number into the present value register. The number of payments is 360, which is 12 months for 30 years. This is entered into the number of payments register. To enter interest, first divide it by 12. So enter 4, division key, 12, and equals key. 0.33 will be entered into the interest register. Now compute the payment amount by pressing the PMT key. For finding the amortization information from the first 12 months, enter 1, press the key marked input, 12, downward shift, amort. You see periods 1 through 12, and using the equals key, you can toggle through the amount applied to principal, interest, and balance remaining.